Unseen, undetected faults in damaged underground power cables can cause objects like streetlights, manhole covers, footpaths, and even roads to become energized with electrical voltages. Osmosis Power Survey Mobile Detection System surveys the underground electricity network and detects faults, heading off both public danger and costly energy leakages. Electrical distribution networks are complex and interdependent systems, and safety and reliability are paramount. But below-ground infrastructure poses a particular kind of risk, as hazards can remain unseen. And at any time, contact voltage could energize structures above ground, leaking power, as well as bringing potential danger to anyone touching them. Awareness of this hidden risk is not the problem, detection is. And that's where the Osmos Power Survey technology really comes into play. And tonight we're going out to find some cable leaks. We begin our journey as darkness falls in what's known as a Mobile Asset Assessment Vehicle, or MAV for short. It's a purpose-built field detector designed to locate low-level electrical fields that emanate on the surfaces of structures. And it's a sensitive, accurate and non-invasive way to locate faults. Sure, and that sounds quite significant. That is a significant peak. As you go through, you can see all the different assets that are around here. There's not a whole lot that are above ground. So there could be coming from the ground. We just don't know. So that's why we'll pull over and we'll do an investigation. The first job for the team is to put the necessary traffic safeguards in place. And having established a qualified earth reference, Sean is now on the hunt for any energized objects. Hey, Marcus, looks like I found a hit. So Sean, what have you found? So we found 53 volts in the asphalt right here. And how significant a find is that? Very significant. You can even feel the heat from the asphalt when you're testing it. You can feel it right in the ground. So you can even feel the heat. What yeah. do you need to do now? Now we will mark this up and we will call it into our dispatch center. Working with Princeton University in New Jersey, research found that the magnitude of contact voltage losses like these could be as high as 590 gigawatt hours across the UK every year, the equivalent to the annual energy consumption of 184,000 homes. It's been a fascinating night, hasn't it? It has, and it's not untypical. Jeremy Wright led this research and told me detecting leaks early can bring both safety and environmental benefits. The cable faults that uh, we typically see can go from one to three years before they become a, a nuisance to customers and in that time they can generate significant amounts of CO2 and a typical fault um, can be 38 tonnes um, per year which is enough to fill 129 double-decker buses. Osmos is already operating in 75 cities in North America, as well as 12 countries across the world, and has supported utility companies to find 250,000 energized structures over more than 15 years. You can have these, these hidden dangers, things that are energized, things that people and their pets can step on, um, come in contact with and, and cause a shock. So it's really important to have a proactive program to go out and find these before they become dangerous. Certainly every system where we've scanned and looked, we always find things. There, there is no perfect system out there that is immune from these. Back on the street, Sean has discovered an unidentified cabinet energized with more than 50 volts. It's close to a school and it's a reminder of the risk this silent danger could pose. Osmos's exclusive power survey technology is the first and only scanning system designed to detect such faults, helping to minimize risks to the public and maintain a system strength and resilience for utilities and their customers.